So if we take a look at the U.S. state of Alaska, it's by textbook's definition, probably one of the most socialist states in the United States, perhaps even the world. Because what state is paying folks by, by virtue of being a resident a sovereign dividend? That's the Alaskan dividend, oil revenue, natural resources. The whole point is not an argument of capitalism and all of that stuff. It's just food for thought that there's different creative ways of raising state-based revenue, government revenue, federal revenue. So we think it's a brilliant idea if there's a candidate or a party platform that advocates shifting the tax burden, not just you know the administrative burden every year, you gotta file a tax return, shifting both the tax burden and the administrative burden of basically, you know, of individual filers, shifting it from individuals to more of a streamlined, you know, a fair streamlined system. They can look at the corporate taxes. Take a look at the Alaskan example, a creative way of raising revenue. So if we think, you know, basically if there's a libertarian ethos, forget about the religion, forget about all the cultural wars, there's a real argument to be made about economic liberty, low taxes or no taxes, Second Amendment gun rights, you know, without all this, the nonsense cultural disputes, we think that's a probably a brilliant idea. So you look at the Alaska example, there's many creative ways to solve existing problems.